Hi, my name is Camilla. I am 26 years old and I live in Amsterdam. And as a side project, I'm making these cards called Knuffelkaarten, with which you can send a cuddle per post. It started at the beginning of the Corona crisis when one close um, friend, a family member got quite sick and I wanted to give him a hug, but I wasn't able to because of the restrictions. So then I decided to make um, a cuddle that you can send per meal. And now that we are in a, in a crisis again, when there's a war in Europe, I made a special card um, also to fundraise money for uh, the refugees from Ukraine. In my normal job, I work as a scientist at TNO, which is an innovation company. Because I originally graduated uh, as a satellite data engineer. So it's, it's very different than what I'm doing here, but I really try to combine these creative elements in my job as well. Because I think creativity is way more than, than drawing and making stuff. It's about problem solving as well. And, yeah, finding solutions for things you couldn't think of in the beginning. I like, you know, because when I work normally in my job as a scientist, I do a lot of work behind the computer, I'm using my brains a lot. But sometimes I really do miss using my hands and drawing and, and creating stuff. So it's really relaxing for me. After a long day of work, I can just get out my, my supplies and start cutting and, and gluing stuff and making things. I try to make the set of cards as diverse as possible so that a lot of people identify themselves with, with the cuddler they are sending. This is uh, Jonah, um, he was one of the first ones I made actually, especially also for the rainbow community. So you can see where the inspiration for this card came from. <laughs> it's actually also from an uh, Amsterdam brand, King Louis. I think it's a designer brand from Amsterdam and uh, yeah, Monica, the woman on the card, is wearing the dress you see here. When I was 16, I lived in India for two years and um, I, I don't know, ever since that I have always felt like a special connection to India and what's happening there I, I care about. So especially when the Corona crisis started, uh, it was really hard to see that a lot of families were struggling with that. So I made this card. She's called Vandana and she's wearing a beautiful sari, which is very typical for women to wear in India. And the money that was sold from this card actually went to a relief fund for people that were struggling, uh, especially women that were struggling with the corona situation. I was born, I think, 20 kilometers from here, so quite nearby. It always surprises me how green Amsterdam is as a city. You, you don't feel like it's a big city where you bike through it. It feels relatively small. There's lots of green water, trees, and I really enjoy that. And besides, there's so much to do. I think there are so many creative people living in Amsterdam that are working on really cool projects and experiences you can go to. So that's what I really like about the city. This is the latest card I made. I actually made it uh, last week and this is the first print on paper. It was a trial print um, and it's a card that is especially made uh, for the situation in Ukraine. So every card that is sold uh, with this lovely pair on it actually goes to Giro555, which is a fund that helps those who had to flee from uh, Ukraine or for those who actually had to stay behind um, and live in a war. What I do, I make the drawings with pencils, like this. And once I finish the drawing, I scan them in. And then I do some little edits uh, on the laptop. And then I send them to a press. And then I get a card. So I make little cuts with a knife. Um, and then I cut the ribbon to the right length and I weave them through the paper and then I attach uh, little hands to it. I'm actually very open for suggestions so if you feel like there's someone missing from the Knuffelkart family as it is right now please let me know, you can share it in the comments.